Well, let's have a scene here. We're right near Herrix, and I want to talk about hopes for the future of Apple's 2022 introductions. So far, we got the worst iPad ever. Partly because of the inconveniences it has. Like the... Like the lightning to USB-C adapter required for the Apple Pencil and one of them. The camera being on different sides of it, on the two models. There's a lot of other problems with it. And then there's the limitations of the iPad OS, which some people are hoping that iPads should be capable of running Mac OS 13 and future Mac OSs. Okay, that's the iPad. Next is the Mac Mini. The M2 slash M2 Pro Mac Mini. That's gonna be not as big of a deal because it's not it's not as slim as the meat as or thin as the what we thought we were gonna get. They're, they're not gonna come in colors. It's just gonna be the standard colors of the just like on the MacBook Air. Mm-hmm. For the M2 and M2 Pro Mac Mini. Apple, please bring back the, the 27 inch iMac. Mm-hmm. The Mac Studio is a way more costly replacement than that. Now you know it performs better, but it's it's technically worse because it doesn't have expansion. Even though Apple went out of their way to prevent the expansion on it from working with the software. Mm-hmm. You know what? Geeks at geeks who are gonna help with this thing find some way to get around the software limitations on the Mac Studio so that you can inter- expand storage. That's one thing you should be doing. Mm-hmm. Software people that that are working to help people that use Apple. So that's the only way we can get the Mac Studio to be expandable. And then yeah, the 27 inch iMac with the. Uh, M2 Pro, M2 Max. That's what I hope comes back. And then the new M2, M2 Pro, M2 Max. MacBook, MacBook Pro. Well, you're doing a good job on the ports, at Apple, but you're missing one of the, only one port that you need to add back, which is USB Type A. You're too busy counting your money from dongles needed for that. But, I mean, I've been telling you why why Steve Jobs ruined Apple. Mm-hmm. But this isn't this video right now I'm making isn't supposed to be a rant. Mm-hmm. Lastly, and hope, and I think this is going to be the biggest screw up of any of them in Apple's history mm-hmm. is the M2. Ultra and M2 Extreme Mac Pro, mm-hmm. which may even be delayed to be an M3. They've been delaying it constantly. Ever since the change to Intel, you've noticed the decline in the number of workstations that they launch. Mm-hmm. And by the time they launched the 2013 Mac, Mac Pro, it was like, bye-bye servers. Mm-hmm. They probably don't even make server software anymore. Anyway, I was gonna say that there, most people are now speculating that M2 Mac Pro is probably not gonna even be expandable. I mean, what the fuck? What the fuck is that all about? What happened to Lenver Ray sockets? What happened to expandable storage modules? Video custom Apple GPUs, because Apple's, Apple's graphics is suffering because they don't, they don't even have their own GPUs, they're discrete GPUs, they just use the iGPU. I know it's messed up, that's where I'm going to end it here. Mm-hmm.